Hello and welcome back to Holistic Healing Hacks. What if I told you that your lack of sleep isn't just making you tired? It's literally clogging your brain with toxins linked to Alzheimer's and dementia. Stick around, because today, I'll reveal the one mistake sabotaging your sleep and the three proven hacks to reverse it. Do you wake up feeling like your brain's stuck in fog? Are you relying on six hours of sleep thinking it's enough? Scientists just discovered that even mild sleep deprivation triggers genetic changes that skyrocket your risk of cancer, brain disease, and chronic inflammation. And here's the worst part. Most people don't even realize their healthy routines are blocking their brain's natural detox system until it's too late. A groundbreaking study found that just one week of sleeping six hours a night disrupts 711 genes, including genes that fight cancer and regulate immunity. This triggers chronic inflammation, a hidden driver of dementia, heart disease, and accelerated aging. Now let that sink in. Your Netflix binge could be rewriting your DNA for disaster. This isn't just bad sleep, this is your body screaming for help. If one week of six-hour nights can cripple your immunity and switch on cancer genes, imagine what years of this do. But here's the good news. Your DNA isn't your destiny. You can rewrite this story starting with two non-negotiable rules that force your brain into detox mode. First, you need seven and a half hours minimum. Why? Because your glymphatic system isn't a quick car wash, it's a deep clean marathon. Each 90-minute sleep cycle clears one layer of amyloid sludge, miss even one cycle, and you're leaving toxic trash to rot in your brain. To complete the glymphatic detox, less than seven and a half hours means unfinished housekeeping. Imagine leaving trash rotting in your brain. Over time, this leads to beta amyloid plaques, brain fog, and a 300% higher Alzheimer's risk. Consistency isn't optional. Erratic bedtimes confuse your circadian rhythm, the internal clock that controls hormone release, like melatonin, and cellular repair. A UK biobank study linked irregular sleep to a 52% higher risk of early death. Your body craves routine. Stop treating it like a frat house. Think of your brain like a luxury car. You wouldn't skip oil changes, so why skip sleep cycles? Now, even if you nail the seven and a half hours and stick to a monk-like schedule, modern life has a way of sabotaging your best efforts. Stress, deadlines, that one family group chat, they all keep your brain's panic button, the amygdala, stuck on red alert. That's where these two game-changing supplements come in. Think of them as your brain's night shift security team, working overtime to silence the chaos so your sleep can thrive. First, ashwagandha. This ancient herb isn't just trendy, it's a cortisol assassin. This adaptogen slashes cortisol, the stress hormone, by 30%, calming a racing mind. It's like a natural Xanax for high achievers who can't switch off, tricking your amygdala into thinking you're on a Bali vacation, even when you're drowning in emails. Pair it with GABA, gamma aminobutyric acid, a neurotransmitter that blocks overthinking by quieting the brain's fear center, the amygdala. Now, unfortunately, most oral GABA supplements struggle to cross the blood-brain barrier, meaning only a small amount reaches your brain. However, studies suggest GABA supplements may still reduce stress indirectly by calming the gut, which communicates with the brain via the gut-brain axis, and lowering cortisol through the adrenal glands. Now, while you can't eat pure GABA, these foods increase your body's GABA production or mimic its effects, so grab some on your next shopping trip. Fermented foods like kimchi, tempa, miso, kefi, the fermentation creates GABA, or also green tea which contains L-theanine that help to spikes GABA levels. Nuts and seeds like walnuts, almonds, sunflower seeds, rich in glutamate, GABA's precursor. And one of my favorites, bone broth, which is high in glutamine, another GABA precursor. By calming neural noise, GABA helps you transition into deep sleep, where the brain's glymphatic detox happens. The next game-changing supplement might surprise some of you as it's been around for a while, but mainly has been associated with the health and fitness industry. However, creatine isn't just for gym bros. It's brain fuel, boosting ATP energy in neurons, protecting against oxidative stress, and even improving memory. 
Studies show it reduces mental fatigue by 50% in sleep-deprived adults. No, it won't bulk you up. It bulks up your brain's resilience. Creatine isn't just for muscles. It's a critical energy reserve for your brain. Here's how it works. Your brain consumes 20% of your body's energy, mostly in the form of ATP or adenosine triphosphate. Creatine stores phosphate groups which help rapidly regenerate ATP during high-demand tasks like thinking, learning, or battling sleep deprivation. A 2003 study in neuroscience found that creatine supplementation increased brain energy reserves by 15%, enhancing cognitive performance under stress. Creatine acts as a neuroprotective antioxidant, neutralizing free radicals that damage brain cells. A 2011 study in the Journal of Neurochemistry showed creatine reduced oxidative damage in the hippocampus, the brain's memory hub, by 40% in animal models. This is critical for preventing age-related cognitive decline and neurodegenerative diseases. Now, for sleep-deprived adults, a 2006 trial in psychopharmacology found that creatine supplementation reduced mental fatigue by 50% during 24-hour sleep deprivation, improving working memory and reaction time. For vegetarians and vegans, since they lack dietary creatine, which is found in meat and fish, a 2003 study in the Proceedings of the Royal Society showed they experienced 20% greater memory gains from supplementation compared to meat eaters. And let's not forget elderly adults. Research in gerontology from 2018 linked creatine to better episodic memory in adults over 70. It's safe for all genders and ages. Now if your next question is how do you use it for brain health? Let me answer that for you. For acute needs and sleep deprivation, 10 to 20 grams per day, split into two doses for one to two weeks, will rapidly saturate brain creatine during high stress, like exams or deadlines. Studies show sleep-deprived adults taking 20 grams per day for seven days cut mental fatigue by 50%, according to Psychopharmacology 2006. Older adults taking it for cognitive decline prevention should take 5 to 10 grams per day long-term. Next is omega-3 fatty acids, particularly EPA, eicosapentaenoic acid, and DHA, docosahexaenoic acid, are essential structural components of brain cell membranes. DHA alone constitutes up to 30% of the brain's gray matter, ensuring membranes remain flexible like a well-oiled hinge so neurons can communicate efficiently. When omega-3 levels drop, these membranes stiffen akin to rust slowing a hinge, impairing synaptic plasticity and neurotransmitter function. This rigidity is linked to cognitive decline, mood disorders, and slower signal transmission. Omega-3S, EPA, and DHA are your brain's structural building blocks. They reduce inflammation by blocking NFKB. Low omega-3 levels, your brain membrane turns rigid like a rusty hinge, slowing communication between cells. Supplementing can reverse brain shrinkage in just six months. Like I mentioned earlier, Omega-3S combat chronic inflammation by inhibiting the NFKB pathway, a key driver of inflammatory responses tied to Alzheimer's and neurodegeneration. By blocking NFKB, EPA and DHA reduce pro-inflammatory cytokines, such as IL-6 and TNFA, protecting neurons from oxidative stress and amyloid beta plaque damage. Studies show individuals with higher omega-3 intake have up to a 24% lower risk of Alzheimer's, according to the Journal of Alzheimer's Disease, 2020. Remarkably, omega-3 supplementation can reverse age-related brain atrophy in as little as six months. A 2015 UCLA study found older adults with mild cognitive impairment who took 2,200 mg per day of DHA and EPA experienced significant increases in hippocampal volume, the brain's memory hub. Another trial in neurology from 2014 showed six months of supplementation slowed brain aging by one to two years in adults with mild atrophy. Now, in case you're not aware, I'll let you know how to harness omega-3S holistically. Dietary sources include fatty fish like salmon and mackerel, algae, walnuts, and flax seeds. For supplementation, aim for 1,000 to 2,000 mg per day of combined EPA and DHA. Choose algae-based options for vegan diets. Balance does matter, so reduce omega-6 intake from processed oils to optimize the omega-3 to omega-6 ratio, ideally 1 to 4. Here's a quick tip pair omega-3s with antioxidants like vitamin E and curcumin to amplify neuroprotection. Always consult a healthcare provider if you're on blood thinners as high doses may interact. 
Combine omega-3s with mindfulness practices and aerobic exercise to enhance neurogenesis and cognitive resilience. Your brain's fluidity and firepower depend on these fats. Don't let it rust. By integrating omega-3s into your daily regimen, you're not just feeding your brain, you're rebuilding it. Okay, now before we continue, if you're ready to finally silence midnight overthinking and you want to lower your cortisol, improve your sleep and reduce your mental fatigue, I've put a link in the description to these supplements. Try them for yourself and see how you feel within 14 days. Now, while these supplements are powerful allies for your brain, there's a catch. They can't work miracles. If you're still sabotaging your sleep and doom-scrolling TikTok at midnight, you're practically pouring fancy gas into a leaky tank. So let's lock in the three daily habits that'll turn your bedroom into a brain-healing sanctuary. First, writing down worries before bed tricks your brain into feeling done with the day. It lowers cortisol and prevents midnight anxiety spirals. Think of it as closing 100 browser tabs so your mind can finally shut down. Blue light from screens blocks melatonin by 50% keeping you in daytime mode. Swap it for red light therapy or amber bulbs after sunset. Red light preserves melatonin while easing migraines. It's like a sunset for your nervous system. Wearables like Aura Ring aren't perfect for tracking sleep stages, but they reveal patterns. Did stress spike your heart rate? Did alcohol ruin deep sleep? Use this data to tweak habits without obsessing over perfection. Your brain isn't just a $1 million supercomputer, it's a self-healing marvel that rebuilds itself every night. But only if you give it the right tools. Wanna hack its full potential? Here's your game plan. Sleep like it's your job. Seven and a half hours plus consistency is non-negotiable. Fuel with omega-3s and creatine. Nature's neuroprotection squad. Dump toxic habits. Blue lights at night, not on our watch. Stay curious, heal holistically, and remember your mind is your greatest legacy. Protect it like one. Comment below if you found this useful and what tip you use to unwind. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and follow for more holistic healing hacks. Take care and I'll see you in the next video.